fucking, uh, you know, to be honest, at the start I felt a bit, I don't know why, even when I was warming up I felt good, but yeah. right at the start I, know, I felt like something just wasn't there. Is this like, the first round? It's the first round, like, yeah. I knew like, I need to just warm up, get my body for my fucking head, head there, yeah. and, I, and, I, and I did within the first 30 seconds. I just listened to my corner, press the corner around, yeah. told me what to do. I don't know, it just... There's a lot more confidence in my abilities now because of the first loss. Yeah, yeah, of course. Fucking starting to see. You feel a lot of pressure kind of coming yeah. into it. Uh, maybe, yeah. Yeah, yeah just because of fucking, that's the first, first loss. I've been out for a year of injuries. Yeah. It's been. What was, what injury? Uh, I've done my shoulder, I've had operation, and fuck my rib, it's been up for ages. Uh, just generally, I'm a walking injury machine. I've just yeah. been just an idiot. So, in a way, there was quite a lot of pressure, wasn't really. there? A little bit, yeah. Like, I feel like because of some stuff has been going good for me to start of the year. I just want to just get me off to a proper good start, year yeah, start, and it has. So, I mean, talk, talk me through the uh, submission. Uh, can you well, it? Yeah, yeah, I can remember it, man. It was like, it was fucking. I was, I was. Well, Michael Ross and my Jiu Jitsu coach, best coach around, he was telling me fucking, because I got a new coke, it's called a TP. I just wanted to use that for my guard. But. But again in MMA, you're not going to win from your guard, so I'll, I'll, say, I'll try it if I get there, but yeah. he gave me, uh, had top position, he gave me the armbar. I thought maybe I should hit him, break him down a bit more, but I just went for it. And I was a bit worried, because he, he came on top, but I still had it. And it wasn't the third round, so we weren't fucking sweaty, and I, I, I had a good grip. So you a debutant as well. Um, you see, this probably not much you can go on in YouTube. He felt well. like a debutant, like, you know what I mean? I, he felt like a bit kind of set back, but... Obviously, I'm not gonna fucking get set, really set myself back. I'm gonna go for it. Well, you've got the victory, which is the main thing. Yeah. So, um, do you know uh, when you're thinking about your next fight? Yeah, uh, April 13th, um, Cage Warriors Academy. Okay, fantastic. Yeah, yeah, sweet mate. So, so you're hopefully gonna be pressing this year and uh, yeah, as, much, as much as possible. I want to, I want to get it to be pro as soon as possible, so more the better. What, when, ideally, when do you think? Or when, when you maybe two years, two maybe years. 20, 21. I want to be aiming to be pro. Yeah. Make my whole fucking life. Make my whole life for the next year just fighting. I said to my friends, I'm done fighting for a while, I just want to focus on this, just training, nothing else. That's what I've been doing. You ask any of them, they'll be say he's a ghost fight. You know, you know. Just tell us about where you fight out of as well. And MMA coaches. clinic, uh, head coach Paul Hines, chairman of you know, Diana Dennis in the UFC. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, he's one of my, he trains with me, got a lot of good guys there. Fucking Sharif, my training partner. He's yeah. out at the moment, but he's fucking big things. Yeah. Me and him are gonna come up together. My brother as well, he's got good hands, which needs to get his wrestling up. Yeah. Watch out for him, so yeah. Fantastic. Well, give, um, thanks for talking to us. Before we go, do you want to shout out social media and any sponsors? Yeah, my, so my, I don't really do anything else from Instagram. So I use Facebook. My name's Noah Landers. Uh, my Instagram name's at Noah L N D S. And any sponsors? Or yeah, Bowls of London. They got some fucking nice and uh, nice sport. They got some nice uh, stuff coming out. Uh, mate, the, you can see. They mainly make clothes, it's really nice Japanese. I think it's Japanese, but, no. but it's really, I think, it's, I think it is Japanese, but uh, my memory is fucked. But it is, it is really nice stuff, really comfy. The only trouble is, it's too nice to wear it to walk and get sweaty. Yeah. Listen, I know you're tired. Thanks very much for talking. Yeah, no, I appreciate it, mate. Thanks. Nice one. Appreciate it. Cheers. Nice one.